you can easily make your voice character to be screaming or yelling loudly using Eleven Labs. And let me show you how you can do that. First, let's go to elevenlabs.io and then you can log in with your account and then click text to speech. So I'll show you a few ways you can make the character or the voice to be screaming or yelling loudly. And let's start with something that is simple and then later we are going to use something that is a bit more technical but it will give you much better result now for this example i'll start with the elephant multilingual version 2 which is the best and the cheapest mode at the moment although right now there is actually elephant version 3 that i'll talk about more later on so let's start using version 2 and for the voice let's change it to maybe uh, let's try this one jessica if you spend your whole life waiting for the storm you'll never enjoy the sunshine Okay, so this voice is actually not quite prominent. I think she's a bit softer, but let's make, make her character to be yelled loudly. So let's click this. And I'm going to be using just the default setting, but feel free to change the setting as you'd like. And for this example, I'll try to use this excerpt of a story. I'm going to copy this. And let's paste that to Elephant Labs. Okay, I'm going to read this excerpt a bit and uh, basically I'll, I'll show you the thing that is very important to make the character voice to be yelling so i'm going to read this she found max standing on a chair yelling at the top of his lungs spider huge spider he shouted pointing at a tiny creature crawling on the fence so there's something here that you need to know that the AI model in Elephant Labs can actually understand the story or the context. So I highly recommend to add some emphasis like a description about what is the character is doing. Like for example, add something like yelling at the top of his lungs. And you can also add something like he shouted. So that's kind of giving more context that will have AI to understand that uh, this section has to be louder than the other. So I highly recommend to add that description after all you are the director of the movie or the story that you're creating so you have to be very descriptive for each character now let's click generate speech and uh, let's see the result she found max standing on a chair yelling at the top of his lungs spider huge spider he shouted pointing at a tiny creature crawling on the fence Okay, it's definitely yelling, although it's not very loud, but we can make it even louder. So the second technique that you can try is by making the text, making this text to be uppercase or capitalized. So let's replace it with uppercase letters. I'm going to rewrite this section, spider, and then another exclamation mark, huge spider. There you go. So this is the text. Now it is using capital, capital letters. Let's try it again. She found Max standing on a chair, yelling at the top of his lungs. Spider! Huge spider! He shouted, pointing at a tiny creature crawling on the fence. Okay, that's definitely a bit louder than the first attempt, although this character, which is Jessica, is not very good at something like that, so it's not very good at uh, ex uh, doing the exclamation mark like that, so it's not very loud, but other characters may be able to emphasize the emotion a bit better anyway let's try using the elephant version 3 because it will give you an even more control to make the character voice to be yelling so let's switch to elephant version 3 and now i'm gonna be using just the default setting and we can add something called tags in the elephant version 3 so in this case i'll try to add before the thing that the character needs to say so the tag goes like this it starts with the open square bracket and then the description is uh, yelling loudly or maybe uh, yelling uh, loudly that's going to be useful and then close bracket there you go and then you can click generate speech she found max standing on a chair yelling at the top of his lungs spider huge spider he shouted pointing at a tiny creature crawling on the fence and there you go that's definitely much more emotional than the first two so i think the model that i do recommend to adding some emphasis on the emotion is the elephant version 3 although right now it is it is 
at a discount so i cannot guarantee if in the future you can use this model at affordable rate but hopefully there's going to be some optimization and improvement from 11 labs so you can use this model without paying extra and basically you can add this tag before the section that, that the character or the voice needs to read so you can actually use this feature called enhance alpha that will automatically add some tags in your text but it's still in alpha it's not very good so i do recommend to just add it manually because again you are the director of the story so uh, that's basically other things that you can do to make the character to be yelling loudly in Eleven labs now if you find this video to be useful then feel free to subscribe to this channel and i'll see you on my next video have a great day